alternate dispute resolution or arbitration both have a long way to travel in sri lanka and that's our problem we have to first find ways of how we can adjust to this process while all this is helpful as dr kanagi sen and i were talking you need a change of culture change of culture where disputes can be resolved in the shortest possible time which means we are in a way wedded to the old concept of the trial court whether we have a domestic inquiry we all want to follow the same procedure i don't know why but nevertheless this is one of the challenges that we have to face and that's within us not outside how do you popularize this dispute uh, alternate dispute uh, resolution center was set up in 2018 so there were so many problems that came up now that you got this i want to tell you the government will support it and i would suggest that ministry of justice and ministry of investments also meet and see what support can be given i am sure the justice minister and our state minister can meet in this regard but that alone will not ensure its success if you use the raga palan someone must take the ball and run it's only then the others will come because we need alternate dispute resolutions if we are to succeed as outward looking economy this is some of the areas as was mentioned earlier when you look at ease of business or competitiveness we fail badly in dispute resolution whether in the courts or elsewhere and people remember that in business time is money so time is money you have to remember that and go ahead now we want sri lanka to be a center one is the new legislation which will replace the port city to make it a colombo financial zone with uh, jurisdiction for offshore activity the new law is been drafted by sherman and sterling and we will see the light it will see the light of day before end of the year secondly is the boi will be replaced with a economic commission which is also looking at the resolution of disputes so both these agencies are necessary and i have recommended to uh, dr kanagi swaran to discuss with them and the international trade center which is going to deal with uh, international trade which is headed by dr veera singh so we we be entering a number of free trade agreements we've got one with singapore we are about to uh, finalize one with thailand we are discussing with india of upgrading agreement talk with bangladesh and more than that we are moving to join the rcep that's the largest trading community in the world so this means that alternate dispute resolutions are going to be important and we have to ensure that sri lanka is a center we look at singapore we should be able to match singapore in everything except cost we should be lower then only that you can uh, compete with singapore but it's essential because there is a vacuum in this part of the world for which sri lanka if we move quickly we can fill that vacuum so that's what we have to hunt for secondly the need for all our lawyers people engage in legal services to look outside sri lanka is not a only market it is outside it's not only in this field we have to also focus on new fields you have the different new technologies that are coming ai blockchain so so many the medical field now these are areas we should specialize if we do it now we become the center if we wait someone else will take it so decide whatever you want then the climate change we are going into it in a big way i think our wind power generation of our for green hydrogen and green ammonia some say it's about 60 gigawatts some claim it at 40 gigawatts not megawatts so just imagine how much of business look at solar energy that is there so these are all new fields and these are areas that we should learn now and learn and specialize in it so that in time to come there won't be a major as far as we are concerned we will go ahead so what i'd like to tell uh, dr kanagi sir which he can discuss with the members of the bar association and talk it over with the minister of justice if you want to learn the laws on the new areas government will provide some funding so now don't say we have kept out we are willing to help are you willing to come on the journey with us that's all i have to say thank you